Hello my little children, I'm back with another John Doe video, this time, and it won't be, uh, like it was last time, because that shit was cringy as fuck, and you could tell, like I said, I don't script that shit, because my ass is terrible at spelling and terrible handwriting, so I can't even read my own shit, so yeah, I'm much better reader than writer, so, <laughs> or speller. And as you can tell, I don't have my mic because you don't hear me going pss, 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 or because <gasps> I don't have my microphone today. So if something's quiet, I'm very sorry. Um, sadly, I got a phone with a you no know, headphone jack, and um, I just realized that. So uh, I'm not stopping now. Um, y'all already know I always forget my fucking script or I don't have idea when I start these videos. So let me go fucking thing or something sorry I'm if you hear my uh tablet in the background ringing it's because it's on for some weird ass reason and i accidentally left my notifications on because i'm a dumbass and i don't feel like turning it off sorry just came back from a long day of work you've almost fell asleep three times on the way home you knew you were very tired then when you got into the parking lot, you sprinted to the door and quickly grabbed your keys out of your bag and unlocked the door. You put your stuff down and ran to the bed as you passed a bored doe. Doe's face lit up like a light bulb when he saw you running into the bedroom. He also ran with you into the bedroom as he thought it was some kind of funny competition as he slammed himself into the bed. Like some kind of WWE kid. As he quickly started to grab you into his arms. How was your day, my love? I hope it was great. He looked at you with his big smile. As he gave you a little peck on the head. Still smiling at you with his big grin. Pause in the minute in the story. I had no idea this were his. there's markings on him. Oh, uh, sorry. You looked back at him and gave him a sheepish smile. As he started to hug him back and sit and agreed with, yeah, it was pretty good, but it was pretty long too. Well, I'm happy about the good part, I guess. As he put his head on your shoulder, nuzzling against your neck, he started to wrap his legs around you to keep you be locked into the pose that you were in, meaning that he felt really comfortable in this. And then he loved you very much. For some reason, he felt warmer than what he usually was. And it felt like a big weighted blanket was laying, or laying with you. Even though it was warm, it was still very cold. You decided to get some covers and put it on both of you. He nuzzled against you harder as he was trying to keep you in the pose you were in. Mmm. So, can I please, for the love of God, get some blankets? It's cold in here. Mmm. -mm. Please? Mmm. Please? Mmm. Please? Mmm. Please. Mmm. Thank you. <sighs> Finally. Still cold though. I can make it warm. What? What? Never mind. He hugged you on even tighter in embarrassment. You're squeezing me too much though. You're squeezing me too much. He said as you were being squeezed to death by dough. He let you go and let you breathe. <gasps> as you start to feel tired, your hands stop gripping on dough. Your eyes starting to close a bit. Ooh, I think I'm ready for bed, though. But it's only 5 p.m. I know you don't go to bed, but I do. So please let me go to bed. For the love of God, please. Fine. Hands were shifting up a bit, leading up to his hair. He started to feel it in your hands and playing with it. Toes and stuff. What are you doing? What do you think I'm doing? What are you doing to my hair? Nothing, I'm just really just playing with it. Mm. No, do you not like that? 
Uh, I could so not find none really did that to me before. <clears throat> he hugged you even tighter. You get to still breathe though. As you're about to fall asleep, Toe slowly went up to your ear and said, I love you. Please subscribe, he will watch you when you're sleeping.